this is DC Channel Guns. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What up? This is DC Channel Guns coming at you with a gun video. Appreciate you watching. Like, share, subscribe. I want to appreciate all my subscribers. Appreciate all the good information. I appreciate y'all. Um, I appreciate y'all for supporting the channel and stuff. Like I said, the channel has grown, got bigger. So I appreciate that. Now, we're going to talk about some background checks. Now, when it comes to background checks, um, you know, wherever you at, you know, make sure you check your laws and stuff. Make sure you don't have these on the books and where you at because you have some background checks. And now, if you're going to do a background check and you fail, the gun shops are, you know, they are, by law, has to report you to the police. Now, what that does, they'll launch an investigation on you. Now, see, some of these laws are already on the book in some of these states, like St. Louis and stuff, and Missouri and stuff like that. Some of these laws are already in book. There are some other states who have similar laws. So we must be aware of these laws. And, you know, I see a lot of these anti-gun pretty much trying to put these in the bills and stuff like that. And what they're trying to do, they're trying to have some way where they can say, okay, um, this person is not allowed to have a farm no more. So, you know, if you go for a background check and something happens, you fail, they're trying to come and confiscate your gun. There's a lot of forms of confiscation out there when it comes to your farm. You have to be aware of that. And I just want to put that out there. But like I said, the fight doesn't end. And they're trying any little niche, any little thing that they can throw in there to come and backtrack and take your farm. So they know there's a lot of gun owners out here with farms and stuff like that. And they're saying, hey, if this person run into the law and then he tried to get another farm and stuff, guess what? He can't He can't get a farm, so guess what? We must take the farms that he already has. So they'll launch an investigation and come confiscate your weapon. So we must look at laws like that. You know, these are the laws that when they say they want to pretty much, um, you know, enhance the background check. Every politician I have seen running for some type of um, gun law saying they want to enhance the background check system. That is one of the things that they're trying to do. Now, don't be mistaken. They're saying they want to enhance it because they're trying to put protocols in there where if you fail the background check, guess what? The gun shop, wherever your background check was ran, they must report that you failed the background check to the police station. What that would do is launch an investigation. And when the investigation comes and further investigation that, hey, you can't own a farm, then they're going to come and confiscate the, arm, the farms that you have. So you have to be aware of the laws and stuff. So like I said, when it comes to the background check that all the states and all the politicians keep talking about, there's one protocol that they're trying to throw in there, enhance background check. Because if you fail that background check, they want the launch investigation to come get your farm. So I just want to put that out there. So I appreciate everybody's support. Appreciate you subscribing and stuff. So this is DC Channel Guns, and I'll catch you on the next one. This is DC Channel Guns. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.